Was there a point when you started to think, my gosh, am I ever going to come back? Um, there was a little time where it was rough, especially with, with how the team was doing. But uh, I just tried to stay positive and, and help out in any way I could. But it uh, feels good to be back now, and now it's time to get back on track. It took so, a little longer than people thought. Were there any yeah. setbacks, or did it just take a little longer? No, it really was just waiting the bone for the bone to heal. It really wasn't anything that I could do. You know, it was just waiting for the bone to heal. Couldn't couldn't really rush my body, so it just was what it was. How so much have you got to throw with Jamarcus? I mean, during the, during all the rehab time. I mean, you guys had seemed to have a chemistry. You had a Dallas game, you mm -hmm. threw you five times, you caught them all. Um, <laughs> really, we we got some good work in last week. I got some good limited practice, and I got some good routes on air. And uh, again, this week, so we've got about a little, little bit more in a week. And uh, I've also been running routes on off days, so run as much as I can, and uh, we'll work on it and fine tune it this week, but that's about it. Running well, routes with him? Or yeah. Running routes with him? Yeah, I've been running routes with him. Was this a case where you want, when you came back, you want to make sure you were 100% that yeah. you didn't come back on 80% that never set yeah. back? Yeah, I think it was, because they want they needed to make sure the bone was all the way healed. Otherwise, if, if, if I would have done it again, it would have been a really bad situation. So. How much difference do you think you could have made? I mean, the this passing offense has not gone anywhere. I mean, do you sit there thinking, how you could have made a difference in these first six games? Um, at times, but really, there's there's not much I can do than other than than help the guys out with with stuff that I see. But uh, you know, now that I'm back out there, hopefully, hopefully I can make a difference. What, what have you? What seen? do you see, Chad? Um, really, really, what I see is they don't they don't respect us our past game. They don't respect us very much, and uh, we got to earn that respect back. And I felt like that's where we were, we're in the preseason, but it's been we got to get that back. So, so when what you do say you bring, Chad? Do you see opportunities? There? Yeah, yeah, I definitely do. When they're they're trying to load load the box up, so I feel like you know they're challenging someone on the outside. So got to take advantage of it. And what do you bring, Chaz? Uh, hopefully, just a little more physical nature and uh, just a positive attitude for right now. How much can you play? Are you limited at all? I don't know for right now. I don't know. I got to ask the trainers. But uh, but for right now, I know that I'm cleared to, to practice everything I, and and the whole practice. So. Do you expect to start? I don't know. That's up to the coaches. It's up to Chance, the coaches. A lot of things with a quarterback and a receiver come down to chemistry. Mm -hmm. We've seen it with you and, and Jamarcus. We've seen it with Jamarcus and Zach. Mm -hmm. Just talk about how critical that is to, you know, making it work. Yeah, it is critical. The practicing, the timing, and, and the trust is, is a big issue. And, uh, you know, we can get that on page on, and practice, get on the same page and, and work through this time right now and, and get back going in a positive manner, get some good passing yards, some big plays downfield. It's all, all stuff we got to fix in practice, though. So. So you can consider yourself rusty, raring to go, or a little bit of raring, raring to go. I don't feel that rusty. I got I got that out most last week, so I'm, I feel good. I feel very good. Have what you been did working you think on both sides, or um, still the one? Just uh, <laughs> I've been actually going both sides. So, okay. Yeah, that's it's really up to the coaches how they want to use me for right now, but uh, can't re can't really answer that. What did you really think of the play of the rookies in your absence? Um, they've been doing well. They've been really picking up their blocking game. They've been more physical. It's just the fine-tuned stuff of catching the ball and, and, and just the fine-tuned fine, fine -tuned stuff of making plays. And I feel like Lewis Murphy's making great strides. He's, he's, he's a very good route runner. We just got to work on, on, on the big plays, and he's, he's, he's going to be there for us. And same with Darius. So, Along with your excitement, do you feel any, any pressure? Because you're still a young guy. Mm -hmm. You don't have a lot of career catches. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, the team has been treating your injury as very important and mm -hmm. key to Jamarcus's development. Yeah, I feel if they're going to put me out there, I feel like it's my job to go out there and make plays. I've always said that, and they, if, they, if they're putting me out there, they have confidence in me, and I'm not going to go out there and not do my job. So, yeah, I need, I need to go out there and, and do some, make some plays and, and, and help the team win. You know, you're surprised by, by how much has been put on your injury. I mean, you, you came on late last year. Yeah. You had 15 catches, mm -hmm. and when you went down, I mean, it was like really, this I whole just, passing offense just <laughs> fell apart. Um, I can't really answer for that. All I know is that what we had working was, was something very special mm -hmm. and that if we can get back to that as soon as possible. But uh, I feel like I, I can help the team win, so that's what the important thing is, and winning.